And welcome back, this is Bello Scoopa with more Let's Play Stardew Valley. I'm joined as always by my very advanced level farmer, Bello Scuba. When we last left off, we had quite a bit of money. I'd been playing for quite some time, but there was still a lot that I wanted to do. Um, unfortunately, a lot of that just kind of requires money at this point, so we're hoarding money for a while. All right, weather report says cloudy tomorrow. Fortune teller says good humor, a little extra luck today. All right, let's talk to the missus. Yeah, had trouble sleeping last night, so I filled around my workshop for a bit. Here, I made this for you, and she gave me a refined quartz. Hope we can find some use for it. Uh, possibly. <laughs> we'll have to see. All right, let's uh, toss the baby around. Oh, no, the baby's too big. Uh, we will just uh, talk to the baby. All right, what do we have down here? We have one thing ready. Uh, pomegranate wine. All right, well... Not quite what I was hoping for, but probably better than a lot of uh, what could have been down there. Wow, I forgot that I like uh, had to end the last session uh, with just a whole bunch of stuff. Um, for those of you that uh, aren't watching this as it goes up, um, this is the first one that I've done after another round of sickness. Second one, this Let's Play, that actually prevented me from uh, recording for a while because I could not talk. Greetings from Calico Desert. Uh, come visit me soon. I'm really bored out here. I've included a gift from the desert. You can come and thank me in person. Sandy sent us a cactus fruit. Right, well, I have that. Um, the, uh, the giant totem. Have a few of those going. Have some truffle. Um, I'm still working on copper. Okay, let's assume I'm working on copper. Alright, a whole bunch of stuff here. Still have to go, like, around the Scarecrow, which is not ideal. Yeah, I can't squeeze between there. Okay. Let's see what I can do here. I do have four iron bars. <laughs> Once again, I just have, like, kind of random stuff right now that I have to figure out how I want to deal with. Um, I don't have too much trash here, do I? It was mostly stuff that I want. Alright, that goes there. Those can go in there. Let's continue trying to work on... One, two, three, four. Continue working on the, uh, quality fertilizer. Alright. Let's try... Do I have enough coal for this? Okay. That is good enough for now. Let's kind of put all that away. For now. Um, there's going to be other uses for it. But for now, I think that is the best for me. I do have two kegs. Like, why do I have kegs on me? <laughs> why couldn't I plop those down somewhere? All right, well, I don't seem to, to need anything there. Most of these fences are just kind of deteriora deteriorating right now. We'll grab all of that. Grab all the eggs. Um, I don't think I need to talk to the animals anymore. This is what happens when you're away for too long, which has been a, often in this Let's Play, that I just have to take a, a long break from it sometimes. Um, it's not on purpose. It's not like I don't like the game. I really do like the game, just uh, sometimes I sit and play it for too long. Uh, so it, it's a while before I have to come back and record more for it. And I'm out of room. All right, let's... Uh, deal with some of this. We'll turn this into cloth. I think that was still uh, the best there. And then uh, eggs can go in here. It looks like I, I missed a couple days. Or at least one day when it came to this stuff. But 
that should be enough room for me to head in here and deal with uh, the rest of at least the trees. We can also try to get more of the ancient fruit. Don't stop saying to eat the peach. I, I want to grab more peaches. All right, let's, let's switch to something that I can't eat. All right, a lot of ancient fruit done. Yeah, I'm not sure how much of this I'm going to be able to turn into um, wine at the end of it. I might have to take away like the silver ancient fruit at some point, but I'm still working on getting a lot of kegs going. That is definitely a priority for me. Just get a ton of kegs. I do want to see how much is done. All right, my two kegs can go up here. I think I was short on wood from making more kegs. Um, yes, that, that was the limiting factor for me now. So we'll have to try to work on that for now. Um, is it really storing all of the ancient fruit in here? I feel like that one can be sold. The, the stack of the gold ancient fruit can probably just be sold. So let's kind of deal with it that way. I'm probably going against a lot of things that I said last time, but uh, you know, it makes sense to me. I still have some star fruit, right? Star fruit can go in here as I continue to make more kegs. All right. At some point, I will have enough oak resin. And I will not need uh, all these trees anymore. I'm not entirely sure when that's going to be. I don't have like a number in mind. But at some point, it's going to be more beneficial for me to chop those trees down than anything else. All right. Um, this is new. Okay. That's what I get for all this? All that work. Is this watered? No, I need to water it. Wait, wait, wait. I have the slime charmer ring for this. Okay. So all that work and I got 11 slimes out of it. That, that doesn't seem like a good investment at all. Like that seems counterproductive for me to spend my time working on that. Um, we'll see if it, like, starts getting, like, maybe a little bit better over time, but, uh, chances are that's just not going to work out for me. Uh, I still had some milk. That can be turned into cheese. Um, eggs. That's the next thing. Any more eggs? There's some eggs. Okay. So, was there a plan today? I'm not sure there was. Um, one plan that I had was to uh, hoe you and plop you. We'll put you there. That, that should be fine, right? Not, not in perfect position, but in good enough position. I actually like it if you were here a little bit better. That works for me. Okay, so let's sell at least something today. <laughs> Ancient fruit, uh, cheeses, uh, the pomegranate wine, the mayonnaise, the truffle oil, and the void mayonnaise. That all can be put in there. All right, 
Let's put the coffee in there. Um, the slimes, the maple syrup. I don't really have that much room left in here. I have so much crap in here. Um, that can go in. And I think that's it. Let's put the uh, the diamond away. I have so many diamonds. That is a ton of diamonds. 51 diamonds. What am I going to do with all that? Uh, the, uh, the apricots can go in here. That's kind of what I've been working on. All right. Uh, I should take the copper and iron bars and uh, move them over to my uh, making kegs chest I, I think it's I think it's a chest over here yeah, there's nothing in there we'll do it like that I guess okay so I think the plan today is to go to Clint's and um, to the Adventurers Guild to try to sell some stuff and and turn some stuff in and all that kind of stuff. Um, right, I'm working on... Did I already make uh, fall seeds? They would be in here if I did. I did make fall seeds. Okay, so I don't need fall seeds. I can take that off my list of things to make. All right, so is that all I can really sell right now? Yeah, let's just go ahead and sell the uh, cactus fruit. It's not going to be super useful for me anyway. Uh, cloth can go as well. All right, come horse, come Toto. We have rains to bless. If that song makes no sense. Uh, let's go to town, but it's catchy, so people love it. Okay, Clint, process some stuff for me. What is that? Pyrite, not what I'm looking for. Very specific one thing that I'm looking for right now, and I seriously doubt it's gonna show up. Like it hasn't to this point. Why would I expect it to later on? Let's go to the quarry. I think that's the fastest way. Oh, there's, there's a bit going on here. I could deal with this. It's also a mushroom for me. It's common. How dare you? Um, yeah, I could try to get more stone out of there. I do need a lot of stone as well. Let's sell my lead rods and the uh, thermal boots. Just mostly because I don't have anything particularly uh, important to do today. But I think the, uh, the next stop for me is going to be here at the quarry just clean this up clear out my uh, basically rock farm here back to the bus stop get on the horse and ride so the things that I'm looking for right there there there's only one major thing and those would be the uh, the ocean stones I, I just need one of those and it's not showing up here. Which isn't that surprising. Like I said, I've gotten the whole game and not gotten it, so why would I assume I would get it now? But, you know, I can hope and dream. And right now, that's that's basically what uh, what I'm trying to do. Just hope and dream. Uh, things will turn out for me. Keep plugging away and eventually I will uh, get the things that I want. That's the hope at least. Apparently I'm just going to leave the horse behind. Oh, I forgot to get the stuff. Forgot to get my pickaxe and, you know, the tools that I use to get this done. That'd probably be important. We can deal with this while I'm here. Uh, I'll hold on to those because I need that for, 
for the kegs. So they're going to go over into the keg thing. All right, we'll get on the horse this time to save me a little bit of time to make up for the time that I wasted. That makes sense. Let's head back to the quarry. Try to get some rocks here. We'll see what I can do. Get at least something. A little bit of coal wouldn't hurt either. All the other stuff basically can be sold, but I have better ways of making money these days than uh, selling random gems that I pick up from the rocks out, out here. It makes me think that this game ne isn't necessarily balanced all that well, considering how much money I need and what I'm trying to do to get that done, and I'm still not really even close. that I need so much of just everything. Um, I might go back to, I think it's Robin, and buy the uh, the wood from her that I need. Um, because ultimately, that will make me a lot of money in the long run. Uh, to buy wood, to use it for something that makes me more money. All right, back to the bus stop we go kind of just deal with the rest of this and uh, we might call it a night a first night back once again not always all that productive but I got a few things done you know it wasn't a complete waste by any means we always seem to do some things uh, just not necessarily what I always set out to do not at least when we started all right, we'll put the jade and the topaz away, and I think we'll just call it a night. Anything to say? Make sure you don't leave your tools out in the rain. You wouldn't want them to get all rusty. I mean, that is good advice, but uh, I don't see how that, uh, that could happen. All right, let's go to sleep for the night. Made a bit of money. Most of that's got to be the uh, the ancient fruit, yeah. So a little bit under 45,000. That is not bad. And we're on to day eight. And Ruby got something. Sorry about that. There's just something about me recording this game that makes her want to do things. Um, all right. What's the weather for tomorrow? Cloudy with gusts of wind. Fortune teller says, very happy. Um, that's not what I'm looking for right now. It will be later, but not right now. All right, Bobo seems all right. Uh, winter's just around the corner. We need to double check the heating system, turn off the valves, and check all the insulation in the house. Don't worry, I'll take care of it all. Don't worry, because uh, it's not a mechanic that I can handle. Oh my, look at all that's done here. Uh, spice berry wine, it looks like. Um, lots of things done. Um, nothing that I was really looking forward to, but, uh, all right. Four, five, eight, eleven, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 11, 13, 14, 15. need 15 out of here. Let's see if I can find all those uh, all those casks again. There we go. That was uh, simple enough, but we got a lot done out of there. So we can finally sell some of the wine that we've been aging this whole time. We'll see how much money I actually make from there. Hey, the cranberries are done. All right, let's sell all this wine right off the bat because that's eating up a lot of room in my inventory. Not sure it's going to sell all that well, to be honest with you. Um, I think I've mentioned it before, but uh, in case you have forgotten or you didn't hear it, uh, aging doubles um, the value of the wine. So if it didn't start off all that great, it's not going to end up all that great either. Are the Junimos not working? 
apparently they are working. Okay, they're, they're just really, really slow. All right, we're gonna pick all these cranberries. Um, it is cranberry time. And hopefully, this will uh, this will be enough to, to make me quite a bit of money. Uh, I'm pretty much gonna sell anything with any sort of star on it. Um, yeah, the Junimo's not so helpful. I'm sure that if I arranged it properly, I could get them to handle the entire farm um, by itself, you know, so I don't have to do anything um, in this kind of situation. But ultimately, you know, when we're talking about hundreds of cranberries that I'm harvesting, and my finger's starting to hurt. Um, it's just something that I want to take care of myself. They're, they're just too slow. Let's, you know, pick up the pace a little bit here. And I think those are the uh, rare seeds. All right, so a total of uh, 396 cranberries, apparently. We'll see what else uh, the Junimos might have gotten. Anything uh, else in here? Yep. So uh, over 400 cranberries as a result of that. As I said, though, I'm going to just go ahead and sell anything with a uh, star on it. So over uh, 200, not quite half, but close. I was going to sell those star fruit uh, that are gold. I don't remember them picking those up, but must have done it... Uh, after I thought they were already done. Okay. Let's head down here. Pick up some, uh, some truffles. If I can. No! I got, uh, the tree hit by lightning and, uh, a couple things of coal came out. It was off season for that anyway. All right, a couple things of wine here done. Okay, hold on again, I'm sorry. 